morning class. We've come to the last lap of uh, numerical processes too. And the last topic, the last subtopic under that topic is percentage uh, error. We have the following objectives to cover under percentage error. First one, we are going to explain the meaning of percentage error. Second, we are going to study the formula for finding percentage error. And the last one, we are going to solve problems involving percentage error. But before we do that, I want us to look at the following definitions under percentage errors. Now, percentage error is defined as the relative error expressed as a percentage. Relative error expressed as percentage. Error is the mathematical mistake made in the course of measurement or calculation. The mathematical mistakes that you make in the course of measurement or in your calculation is known as the error. Now, we are talking of absolute error here. Absolute error is the same thing as the error we are referring to here. Absolute error is the assumed error minus the actual error. Sorry, minus the actual value. The actual value is the accurate value, but as a result of mistakes, you later end up having a different value. So if you want to get the errors here, is assumed value minus actual value. Now, we also have the formula for percentage error. Percentage error is relative error multiplied by 100. Relative error multiplied by 100. But you need to get your relative error from this error over actual value. So from there, I can say percentage error is error over actual value multiplied by 100. Now, we have this first example. The length of a pole is 5 meters to the nearest meter. The length of a pole is 5 meters to the nearest meter. What is the range of the actual length? That is A. B. Calculate the percentage error. Now, Since the measurement is in nearest meter, now this five meter is standing at the actual value. Sorry. Your actual value is five meter. So the error that you have in this to the nearest meter, you can have, instead of you measure legs, that is 4.95 meter, or you measure more than the actual value, 5.5 meters. So therefore, this is the range of what you can have. So it is going to be plus minus 0 0.5 meter. Plus minus is 0 0.5 meter from the actual value. And that will be your error. So your error now, your error is plus minus 0 0.5 meter. So that is for A. B. Your percentage error now from that from that percentage error is according to percentage error is relative error multiplied by 100. Relative error multiplied by 100. So for you to get your relative error, your relative error is the error which is zero. 0.5 plus minus 0 0.5 all over actual value 5. This is your relative error. Now you now multiply by 100 to get your percentage error. Percentage error will now be 0 0.5 plus 
over 5 times 100. 5 here, 1, 5 here, 20. And 20 times 0 0.5, your percentage is off. We give you plus minus 10 percent. So, thank you very much. You see more problems in your Google Classroom. God bless you.